Hey y'all, I'm gonna do a quick flip before the month is over of November. And I, a new pocket planner binder, everything's still the same. I had been um, experimenting with some different covers and I went back to A6 for a little bit, but it really didn't, um, I don't know, it just like, it didn't work out. So here in the beginning is still like kind of my notes section, random. Um, and then I have a to-do section. These are by Noted, by Post-it. I think I got them a few years ago, maybe at Target. Here's my list section. So I've just got lists that I want to kind of keep on hand to reference. And then here's my project section. And in the front, I have kind of like a holidays one. So this is just paper that I cut down from um, like a notepad. I got that at Walmart. They have a couple of cute ones. And um, so I've got, you know, like snack ideas, activities that the kids and I want to do. And then here's my reference pictures for when we were moving into our house. I just kind of kept this as like inspiration for my office and, you know, etc. <laughs> the page doesn't want to turn. Um, the kids are going to go camping soon. So I have just like a list of random stuff we're going to need. Going to help my brother plan his graduation party. And then I just have some blank pages that I've um, cut myself to, you know, randomly have for brainstorming and stuff. And then here's my calendar section. I made these little dividers. Everything, like, is homemade and sometimes kind of janky, but it's functional and that's my, that's my goal. This is a card by Paper Test Designs that I just printed on some like thick cardstock and taped on here. Um, and then here's my yearly overview and my month on one pages. These are by Nada Notes. And I just have these little sticky dots that also are from Noted by Post-it. They don't make these anymore, but I have tons of them because I just bought a bunch. That's kind of how I operate. So here's the current month, November, and we're getting really busy. And then I have my week on two pages, also by Nada Notes. Um, usually when it gets pretty busy, I don't pick up my planner as much, so I haven't. I kind of just rely on like a notepad in the kitchen, and that's been working for me. But I do have it printed through the end of the year. So I've got like, I got December here. Then this is my family section with just random stuff, you know, we homeschool. So I've got um, kind of like guides for me throughout the day, random stuff that my kids made. These are just like daily goals and reminders, like to give the kids my full attention, to give my home my full attention, not be distracted, make sure, you know, the sink is clear, dinner's prepped, things like that. Um, an outline of kind of how we do our studies or curriculum. We don't have super structured, but I do plan it out. And, you know, we go over certain lessons and stuff. Um, just notes here, more of those blank pages, a blank list pad. These are from the Dollar Tree. Again, just bought a bunch of them. I've had them forever. And I do see them still when I go, so I know that. Um, they even have them in like blue and yellow, I think. So if you don't find them at a Dollar Tree, you go to maybe just try another one because they're almost always there. Um, here's random notes and stuff for studying and drawing that I'm doing. It's um, a lot of like personal projects, I guess you could call it notes. Some Etsy stuff, but as I've mentioned before, Etsy is not really a priority. I've never really put a lot of effort into it and I don't see that happening anytime soon. More blank pages. These I got on Amazon. They're A7 pocket size and they're just super cute. I think Nuo Bestie is the um, shop or what's it called? Like the manufacturer. Then I just have an ideas for um, meal prep and like meal ideas that I keep on hand. So smoothie, snack ideas, things that like if I run out of ideas, I'm sure you can hear my kids are playing right now and they're just going crazy with dad. So these are just things that I keep, you know, 
to reference things that I know we like. Um, I think this is like finance notes. I mostly do my stuff on the computer. But yeah, sometimes I just need, you know, like to quickly do some math. And I think one of the kids made me this. Yes, super cute. I love you. I love you. <laughs> That's our six-year-old. Um, and typically I would keep in the back pockets. There it is. Yep, I was going to say I usually keep some cards. But actually when I got this binder, I noticed that the envelope for these cards didn't fit. It stuck out like this much, so I can't keep it. So if I ever need to give someone a thank you note, I'm just not going to have an envelope. And in here... I don't know. I'm trying to do this one-handed. I don't know what I have in my... Oh, I got, like, sticky notes. Um, I think this is a password to my kid's iPad. I've got, like, stamps and um, BC powder in case my husband needs it. Sometimes he gets, like, a headache. And, uh, yeah. And I do have the flyleaf. So, I'm, I'm filming this because I'm about to... I mean, I, I've been using this, but I haven't, like, you know, dedicated a whole lot of time. It's been very touch and go with this. But I um, I really love this binder, so I'm about to do a whole bunch of, you know, like, thorough um, prepping for 2024 and probably redecorating, rearranging. I really want to get some proper tabs. Been saying that for years now. But, I mean, if it's not broke why fix it uh so yeah i was like i need to make a video before uh, i forget because november's almost over and um this by the way is the moterm regular <laughs> 19 millimeters y'all <laughs> let's see okay yeah let's see how long that lasts this is moterm regular pocket rings i believe it is the veg tan in honey so yeah, super smooth leather. Um, picks up every little scratch, as you can see, but I don't mind it. I love it. I love it so much. I love this color. And yeah, like I had tried A6 again, and I really do love A6, but there's just nothing like a pocket. And I'm just a pocket girl, you know? I just know it. That's okay. So thanks for watching. I will update um, whenever I get it all set up for 2024. Might be a little bit, but yeah, happy planning. Hope y'all have.